Welcome to Todd's Two Minute Tech Tip Tuesday, brought to you by Big Beard Battery. Visit BigBeardBattery.com. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. That way you don't miss anything. Hey, Todd here with Big Beard Battery. I'm gonna go ahead and answer the question I get a lot of times. Hey, if you go with a 24 volt system, how do we run all of our 12 volts um, you know, in the RV? So there's gonna be your lights, your fans, and all that stuff. Well, there's a couple ways to handle this. Now, typically what we do is consult with you, uh, the RV owner, and say, hey, if you have the space and you have the weight, why don't we just leave one 12 volt battery in? But I have a lot of you that don't have the space, don't have the weight, and just wanna go completely lithium and have everything set up to 24 volts. So then how do we take that 24 volts and step it down to 12 volts? Well, Vitron actually offers an Orion DC to DC converter. So it's a 24 volt input 12 volt output, and this thing can push up to 70 amps. So this is a wonderful solution to be able to go with a 24 volt system and still be able to supply the 12 volts to your RV. Now, the one thing I do wanna point out, this is actually 70 amps max. What we have to look at is your entire load, right? It's not so much about the fans and about the lights because 70 amps can totally handle it. The question is, is how big is your slides? Um, are you trying to start your generator, okay? Now, if you have a generator in the RV, like an onboard generator, you're definitely gonna need a couple of these, and quite honestly, it would be better to leave a 12-volt battery in to start your generator. But let's say if you don't have a generator, if you have large slides, or if you have a hydraulic leveling system, you may need to get two of these and put them in parallel. This is very small, very powerful, but in order to get your RV off the truck or something like that, with a hydraulic pump, there is a spike in the very beginning, and these don't do well with spikes, so we would have to get two of these. Now, typically on a large fifth wheel, I go ahead and if I'm gonna put in a 24 volt system and delete the 12 volt system, we'll go ahead and put two of these in parallel. This is the Orion 24 to 12 DC to DC converter. There's your tech tip. Hey, if you got questions about batteries or wanna go ahead and put in a solar system, but need some guidance, Head over to BigBeardBattery.com, fill out the solar design form, and one of our certified solar experts will give you a call and get you started. <laughs> That's right. There's your tech tip. Bam, in one shot. You got nothing. <laughs> not, not. Tap. Little left hand. Like this. I was doing this.